So the idea came when I was working at my previous job and during that job the pandemic hit and then everyone was like working from home, right? In that time I saw like a lot of startups popping up in Pakistan where which were mainly based around natural products, not just like skincare but also natural food and you know organic items that are easily readily available in Pakistan but we don't do not have e-tail access of that. So um, I started thinking why is there this big gap between brands and sellers, like resellers. There was a huge gap between the two and so I decided to bridge that gap with Live Natural, which is a multi-vendor natural product store online. And um, you could just call it an e-tail network with all of these small local businesses that are being supported through our channel. Being an entrepreneur is a very lonely journey in itself because you are supposed to pick yourself up, you are supposed to do everything on your own and when I started off I had nobody, obviously I didn't have money to pay anybody and I had nobody doing anything for me either. So um, I had to literally bootstrap along the way for quite some time. So I started off in July 2020 and the opportunity for She Loves Tech came in around November, uh, she loves step competition was in November. So um, what happened was during this journey when I like explore, I was exploring how can I reduce this sort of loneliness and try to find the similar ecosystem of the starter community in Pakistan. That's how I stumbled upon she loves tech. I found out about She Loves Tech first from my sister because she was one of the participants and uh, previous participants and winners of 20, 2019 or 2018. Um, and so she encouraged me when she thought, saw me going on the same journey. She said to really go and explore this opportunity. I was already following Circle at that time. And when they started posting about it, I started seeing stuff on my social media as well. And that is when I started looking at the application and deciding to seriously fill it out. The whole uh, reason why I explored this entire um, competition was also because I was seeking to have an ecosystem around me uh, because to be really honest, entrepreneurial journey is a very lonely journey and on its own you have to really be your own. You have to pick yourself up and when you're not surrounded with like-minded people, it gets really difficult to continuously do that and uh, with Chilas Tech it gave me a lot of opportunities throughout the way to really uh, inter interact with a lot of people so we had trainings with eye to eye we had mentorship sessions with I had one with Summer and then I had um, Meena I got connected with Meena Tarek and that was like one of the few things and still we are, we are in touch Meena and I so that's like one thing that I feel very grateful for She Loves Tech because if it was not for this competition, I would not have met these mentors or I would not have met or gone through that training that we went, uh, a whole two week training that we had with eye to eye. So um, yeah, that's the main thing and it really made a big difference in my confidence level about my startup, about what I was doing. It made me feel really um, sort of validated if you would say. you get to pitch and uh, people get to hear your pitch so that's one one way you're putting your startup out and the second is that you do form connections and they talk about it so for example when i got connected with meena meena gave me a shout out on her social media and that really helped me push uh, my startup into the, into the right audience right and um, and isi tarah, like when i had my pitch so uh, a lot of people went and like a lot of my friends, a lot of my family and they shared it forward. So they saw my pitch and they were like, okay, well, you did such a good job. We didn't know that you were doing this and stuff like that, you know, those kind of things. So it really did help uh, get the word out, even if it was not for the monetary gain or, or for the being the winner or the title. I think the whole journey was in itself very fruitful. Because I feel like it was one of the biggest stepping stones for me to be more confident. After She Loves Tech, I pitched for Nestio. I got into Nestio. Then I um, 
then I continued working on, I, I think I had another competition and then two, three interviews. I reached out to other people to share my story. I was more confident in how to exactly phrase and um, share my pitch and how to competitively do that. Before that, I didn't even know how to put it into a sentence. Like right now, I can literally tell you, Live Natural is a multi-vendor natural product store online. That's, that's one sentence that sums up everything, right? But before that, I would just scramble for words, how do I explain And I feel like that process really made me, forced me into doing that exercise.